I just finished The Way of Kings by Brandon Sanderson, and I regret to inform you that it is really, really good. I say that because this book is a thousand pages, and I absolutely went into this thinking, there's no way. There's no way this is worth a thousand pages. Nothing is, yes it is. Every page, every chapter, every moment needed to be in there. You might remember that I had to pull this from my TBR jar because I've been so intimidated by this book for so long that it took it took me randomly picking it to be forced to read it. And oh my god, I'm so happy that I did. This is like the best thing that could have happened to me this month. In all seriousness, this is just really, really good. I've become a fan of Sanderson, so I was expecting it to be good. I know people really love it, but like, this is another level from what I was expecting. I will say that the book is, again, a thousand pages, so I set myself a goal of eight days, that's what all my little daily reading goals were, was to finish it in eight days. I thought realistically it would probably be closer to ten days. I did it in five and a half. I could not put this book down. When I wasn't reading it, I was thinking about it. When I was sleeping, I was dreaming about it. It was the first thing that I thought of when I woke up and the last thing I thought of before I went to sleep. Incredible fantasy world building, impeccable pacing for a thousand pages straight, a total masterclass in multi-POV high fantasy of when to balance out the points of view, who you can kind of get rid of for two or three hundred pages at a time and then bring them back in at exactly the right moment when you need their story again. I can't say enough good things about this. I don't know what the book is about. I couldn't tell you. It's a thousand pages. If my life depended on it, I could not adequately summarize what it's about. Uh, I'm not even gonna try. Nope, I immediately blue screened when I started to go in that direction. Just read the blurb. Actually, you know what, have I read the blurb yet? Okay, so like technically the blurb, but like I feel like the blurb really fails to capture the heart of the book, which is what's really so good about it. So like the blurb is gonna give you the technical aspects of like the, the plot beats of that you're gonna see, but it really doesn't capture any of the heart of the book, the what makes it so good that, oh my god, just, just read it, please. A really fantastic opener in this as well, which is super important for a book that's this long. Like you need to get hooked early so that you know you're kind of in for something really good. The prelude and the prologue in particular, the action sequence in the prologue, was incredible. I love the way Brandon Sanderson writes action. It started for me in Skyward and then I read Mistborn and I see it again in this one, but the way that Sanderson writes the physics of an action scene is like unlike anything I've ever read and I, it's one of my favorite things about his work. Oh, I ran out of time. It's really good.